Hello, my name is Kathy G. Johnson and I'm a cartoonist, printmaker, and educator. And today I'm going to show you some of my latest screen prints um, here in the new studio that I've been printmaking at. It's called Binge Press Studio, as well as like uh, combined with uh, Queer Archive Works. It's here in Providence, Rhode Island, and this is where I've been printing. And I've uh, printed a lot of stuff since the last time that I filmed. Um, so I'll show you that stuff now. So the first one that I want to share with you is the Garden Party print. Um, this is a print uh, inspired by vegetables. This was also in conjunction with Southside Community Land Trust. So that is a uh, community organization here in Providence, Rhode Island um, that helps uh, create um, vegetable farms all around the city that community members can grow their own food at. Um, this was for their plant sale, which is where they sell uh, plant starts. Um, it was just this last weekend, and this is the art print version, so this is the version without the advertisement or the text or anything like that. Um, so this is the version. All of these are going to be available at my store, so you can buy them now if you would like. Um, I'm really excited about this one. This one has uh, five layers on it. The green, the yellow, the red, the blue, and then the black line work. So all these colors, all the colors are all overlapped with each other. Um, they create all these, this, this orange, which I am absolutely obsessed with, is actually the red and the yellow on top of each other. I just thought that was very successful. I'm very proud of how that came out. Yeah, and that's the first one. Um, number two, so this one is titled A Mouthful. And this one is inspired by all the paintings. So I've been doing uh, a lot of paintings um, over the pandemic. I've started like a painting practice. You can see them on my website. Um, but uh, so I wanted to see if there was a way I could do sort of the experimentation with color the same way that I do when I'm painting. So this is actually only three layers, but it's in total of 12 different um, inks. So there's 12 colors and then they swirl together to create like a whole bunch of different gradient colors and then they're overlapping each other. And so I just wanted to be able to create a lot of variety and also make it so that my painting practice is like more accessible because what I love about printmaking is that it's an accessible and cheaper medium. So I love that it's affordable. So this one's also on my website. Um, it's an edition of A. Um, and that's print number two. So print number three is... <laughs> so I am, as you can see with my hat, I love the television show, Our Flag Means Death. So I made this uh, big boy print. This is 23 and a half inches tall and 10 inches wide. So it's a tall, tall, long print. It's titled Blackbeard's Heartbreak. Um, and it's inspired by the flag, in addition to elements of the television show. So there's the um, heart that's being stabbed, of course. Um, there's the tears. And then there's the rapier, the um, sword, uh, getting stabbed into the eye. Um, but if you haven't watched this show yet, um, you really should. But what's exciting about this is that it's on black paper, which is really cool. So like the white uh, was the actual print. And I can show you some positives of that. I'll go grab them. Um, so the actual black, the black line work is the paper itself. So I printed the white and then the black of the paper comes through as the line work, which was really fun. Um, I haven't done something like that. And so this was like a fun um, challenge. And I really think it came out well. I think it's really cool. I think it's awesome. And you can buy it now. Um, I'll go grab those things. So this is the positive that I was working from. So you see how it was, the actual print itself was the skull and then the paper um, was the outline. So it's actually the uh, a sort of a negative 
of the final image. And also, the heart was printed white and then it was printed red on top because that way the red is really vibrant. So if I didn't do that, the red would be like really dull because um, it's a pretty transparent ink. And so the black, the paper would come through and it would dull the red. So it's actually white and you can see it. So all the prints have a little bit of uh, offsetting. So you can see the white um, along the edges, which I think is cool. But I have another Our Flag Means Death print. And these, instead of, um, instead of screen prints, these are risograph prints. So I have two risograph prints um, on the risograph machine here at Binch. So this is the first one. This is an illustration of Blackbeard and Steed looking cute. Um, this is just a uh, fun uh, love art. I just love romance. And so when I watched the show, I just like had to draw it. Um, so this is also available. This is like in, uh, there's like a, I have a lot, it's an unlimited edition, but you know, it's still limited because I'm not gonna print them forever. Um, but you can get them now at my store. This is 11 by 17. Um, this is the one that's actually yellow and burgundy on top of each other. And they created this beautiful brown, which I'm obsessed with, but there's a few other colorways. There's a black colorway and there's offset burgundy and yellow, which is like cool because they're like kind of offset and they kind of are a repeated image, which is fun. Um, but I had a really fun time drawing this and making this. And it's fun that I have access to the risograph machine because the risograph machine makes it so I can do like more pencil line, more finer detail than I can get with a screen print. So I love having those different printmaking options now available to me. Yeah. And then the last one, this is a, a blood warming warning. It is fake, don't worry, but this is a scream fan art. So this is my scream fan art that I made. <laughs> This is Stu and Billy. Um, this is also, this is two layer risograph. So you can see the red is one color of risograph ink and the black is another color. Um, I'm pretty proud of this. I love Scream. Scream is great. Um, so this is, an, and also risograph involves less labor. So the risograph prints are just gonna be, char uh, are gonna be cost less than the other uh, screen printing prints because screen printing is just more labor. It's just more physically involved. Uh, and the risograph is a machine. And now I think I'm gonna give you a little tour of the studio. So here is the risograph uh, machine. It is a Rizzo. SF9450, which is much more, you guys, some of you might know, I have a risograph at my house, but this is a much newer machine. It has a lot of, we have a lot of inks for it. Look at all those ink drums, which is very fun and cool. So this is where I've been screen printing. so much for watching this video I really appreciate it I forgot to record a goodbye in the studio and then people came and then I got embarrassed and that's something I'm gonna 
gonna work on. Um, thank you so much for watching. Um, you can get everything that you saw in this video in the link at my store, at my website. Um, I really appreciate it and I'll see you on the next video. <laughs> Bye.